Carl Summer, president of Reliable EVM, has a wealth of machining experience. Having worked as a machinist, tool and die maker, foreman, tool designer, and operations manager, Carl now shares with you from his wealth of experience. Incredible wire EDM. We're going to examine some of the amazing things that can be accomplished with wire EDM. Now I go back, way back, when I used to work with a filing machine and hand files. Then I did precision grinding, and I would grind within a tent, all kinds of curves and angles, very painstaking work. Then came electrical discharge machining and revolutionized machining. One of the incredible things about YEDM is that we can machine to plus or minus one-tenth of a thousand. To give you an example, an average hair is two and a half thousand thick. So if you blow it up and you cut it 25 times like this vertically, that is an example of one-tenth of a thousand. This is a snowflake that we often show our customers to show our accurate we can wire EDM parts. I want to place this on our Zeiss inspection machine over here so you can see the accuracy. Now this is the snowflake, and I'm going to push it out over here. And this gives you the timing there of the escaping air coming out of that snowflake. Close to 30 seconds it takes for that escaping air. For this experiment, we're not going to use the timer. So what I'm going to do is push the snowflake up and put it back again. And notice it goes slowly, but the minute it gets air, it immediately drops down. I'm going to put a line on this snowflake. Now I'm going to take it and take it out. I'm going to rotate it. Two spaces here, as you can see. And this gets a little tricky getting this in again to line up exactly right. There she goes, just like before, slowly descending. That's the accuracy that we have with wire EDM. Incredible accuracy. Plus or minus one-tenth of a thousand we can machine. Now you can see the grains from grinding doesn't match. You can see clearly the snowflake, the image of the snowflake. Now I can take the same thing and push it out over here and do this again and come out over here instantly down. I like to talk about our showpiece that we have over here. And this is an eagle as you can see right over here. And here's Texas. And this would be impossible to machine with conventional machining. Just look at the detail on this eagle and the arrows over here. And then look at the lettering here, reliable EDM. Notice the thin lines that we cut out. And remember, why EDM is like a precision bandsaw. 
Now look at Texas down over here. And there you see the R that we cut out. We left it on there. And then our website. It's all done with wire EDM. Now I want you to look at this scene where we're going to be skim cutting this entire piece. I'd like to show you an example of the finish that we get with a rough cut. Now this is a 40 inch part that I'm pulling out over here. Now just take a look. I'm going to put a flashlight at the other end so you can take a look at it. One of the uh, advantages of wire EDMing is the ability to create tapered parts. And the, how we do that is the upper head of a wire EDM machine, can, you can program it to move independently from the bottom head. And so by doing so, you can program, as you see here, this, this shape is kind of this U-shaped extrusion die, and it transformed into just a diameter. And all this detail is done with the programming, the top plane, and, and then you transition it to this, this uh, diameter at the bottom. Unfortunately, if you were to cut this out of one slug, just drill a hole and just cut this out, since this end is wider than this hole, you can't pull the slug out. So this, this slug was taken out in five different sections, and it's glued back together just to kind of see how the solid would look like you know had it been able to have been removed at one time. This is another sample we have here of tapered cutting where this this shape here again we have a, a diameter on the back and this little shape here on the top and then after we dropped this slug out then we came back through the cavity and, and cut a reverse taper. It's kind of a little oval shape and this slug puts together like that, and this is what they wanted to cut out. So you kind of got a, two tapers in the same part. Now here's a 27 inch tube. They wanted that to cut in half, and at 16 and a half feet long. And we, again, we had to start thinking, we didn't have a machine to cut something so big, but this is what we did. We modified a machine, and there it is in the machine, getting ready to be split. And here's one of our employees inside the tube threading the wire. We do a lot of work for the energy industry here in Houston, Texas. And these are two of our large YEDM machines. We have one over here. And we have this one. And in the X, it goes 50 inches, and in the Y, 40 inches. And it can hold up to 13,000 pounds. The table does not move, the head just moves. And this fills up with water. My son, who is a mechanical engineer, and I wrote this here book, Complete EDM Handbook. You can purchase it. It's also free on our website. It's loaded with all kinds of information about the EDM process. Located in the heart of the high-tech energy capital of the world, Reliable has the largest EDM job shop capabilities in North America, specializing nationwide in wire, RAM, and small hole EDM. Our commitment to our customers and our passion for technology has made us the EDM specialists.